What's up guys, it's your boy Izzy Eddie, and today I'm bringing you a Minecraft tutorial on how to build the best skeleton XP farm in the game using a skeleton spawner. So, what you need for this video, you're going to need what I have in my inventory here. You need two buckets of water, you need two because you're going to make an infinite water source, one button, a pickaxe or two, you might need more because you need to do some mining, getting rid of some stuff, some torches, one glass block, one redstone repeater, three redstone comparators, two hoppers, three sticky pistons, one redstone torch, a bunch of cobblestone or whatever block you choose, it can be any block, I believe, redstone, and w three redstone that is, and one block of redstone. So here's what you gotta do, you come in, so here's the spawner, you have the skeleton spawner, you place some torches on the sides because you don't want them to be spawned on you and have to deal with them. And I have some torches inside the building so I can see better. And what you need to do is dig three up and place three blocks on top of the spawner so skeletons do not spawn and sit on top. You don't want that for this spawner and XP farm. So three up, four down, and four out from each side. So three up, four down, and four out from each side. So it gives you a nice square like this. Okay, now once you've done that, this is where you want your two buckets of water. Well first, let's see, you want to pick your side that you want the skeletons to go down and where you're going to hit them and get the XP. So pick your side that you want that, and then on that side, come dig one down on the floor. One down. So then you have your water, then you have the, the floor look like this. And then here's where you need to place the water. So I'd make an infinite water source by placing a bucket here, a bucket here. That's why you need those two buckets of water. Now you have an infinite water source and you take your buckets and you come in here and you line this wall so the water's flowing like so. Then you need one bucket here, one bucket here, and it's going to bring the skeletons over here and they're going to fall right down here. And now that gets brings me to what you need this for, this contraption here. This is a crusher. So now where's the rest of your materials is? So you're going to need to build, you're going to put this on the end of this so that they fall down, which would be, so this block's where, they're going to, where, the, where the skeletons are going to fall down, this block right here. So I'm going to put a redstone block. That doesn't need to be redstone though. Here's how you make the crusher. So you place a block, miscellaneous block, could be whatever block you want, sticky piston, block there, block there. And then you need to go one up from that block, two out. Yes, two out. Nope, I'm sorry, just one out. One out from that block. So it looks like that. Build it, build it. Fill it in. And then put your glass block right there. Now, so this is where the skeletons are going to be falling down. So this is going to be right, there's going to be a block above here where your water is going over, and then the skeletons are going to fall right into this hole. So that's why, how you want to put it over there. But now you put a block to the side here, one to the side, and you place your button. We'll just go ahead and get rid of this glass block. So you put your button right here, sorry. Your button. I think this can be whatever button you choose, but I've always used stone and it works well. Next, you put a block behind, a redstone torch, one, two, one, two with the redstone, and then you place another block, a sticky piston facing you, a block underneath it, another block, another block, then you have face a sticky piston this way and put a redstone block in between. Now, one block behind it, redstone, one block like that. Now let's go watch, I gotta make sure I'm doing this right, yes, so then you want to place a redstone comparator going like this, facing that way. Then you're going to place a hopper, you're going to crouch, so you crouch on Xbox or you got a shift I believe on PC to make the one go into the other, mine this one, crouch and place it so they're going into each other. You want them going into each other. Next, let me check this again. You place a block right here, redstone comparator facing that way. Then you got a block 
This is for the skeleton spawner. Now you go block one, two, one, two, I believe. Out, out to over that way. So it's gonna be. So your blocks are looking like that. In your place a redstone comparator into a block. Then you have your redstone repeater into another block. And now this is to make it for skeletons. I do not know the specifics for the other, but this works for skeletons. You gotta put 12 blocks of cobblestone here. I only have one, but you wanna put 12 blocks of cobblestone. Think it might be able to be miscellaneous, but just put 12 blocks of cobblestone to be safe. 12 blocks and make sure this is only on one tick. So it should look like that. So now I'm gonna showcase it. You got 12 blocks of cobblestone in here, one tick here. Everything should be good to go. I'll show it quickly here. It's an overview of how it is. I just explained it anyways, but now this dirt block is gonna be where the skeletons are falling down from the spawner, as I showed you earlier. And now I have a couple skeletons sitting there. Now you're gonna hit this button and just wait. Once that's done, you can just come up here, one hit. Hit him with anything, one hit, and boom, you get your XP, and then I dig one forward how I have mine set up in my in my world. Then you can pick this stuff up and put it in chests or whatever. So you get arrows, bones, whatever, and XP from the skeleton thing. So then you have to sit here, and then skeletons will keep falling down, and once you get quite a few, hit the button, and then kill them. So there you go, that you put this on the end over here, that dirt block, see where the skeletons are falling down, so that dirt block would be right there, where the water brings them down. Three out from where this block, the water brings them down, and the skeletons will fall right there, hit the button, and bingo, bango, bongo, skeleton XP farm, and that's gonna be all. That's all for today, I hope you liked it. If you did, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.